What inspires me is when I open my eyes in the morning, I'm still alive. <laughs> I have to tell you, bam, Stamets, <laughs> one more day. Meet Paul, Mica warrior, Star Trek fan, and overall fun guy. Hi, my name is Paul Stamets. I started Fungi Perfecti around 1980. I'm a Mica warrior of sorts. We call this company Starship Fungi Perfecti. I'm a Star Trek kind of guy. So Starship FP has been euphemistically our metaphor for carrying our mission forward. I have a passionate interest in saving this planet and be able to protect future generations. I have been empowered with the wisdom of mycelium and understanding how ecosystems are dependent upon the fungal networks that literally creates the soils that give rise to the habitats that we enjoy. And to protect future generations, we need to reinvest in the mycelial bank that's in nature. And I created this business basically to propel these ideas that I hadn't fully conceptualized, but I had intuited that there was a deep well of information that nature has provided that we could tap into. By far, my favorite thing about the company is to see how the employees are inspired that this is more than just a job. We're on a mission from mycelium. Uh, it's more than that. It's the fact that we share in common um, the interests that as a community, we can be stronger and healthier and better. We've had a lot of research milestones come through the company. Um, I think my, my greatest research milestones was when I finally became involved with the U.S. Defense Department BioShield Biodefense Program called Project BioDefense directly after 9-11. Um, and they tested hundreds and hundreds of our samples. And then went flipping through dozens and dozens of reports to come to sample 79, highly active. Sample 88, highly active. Sample 92, highly active. And they all were Agaricon, Fomitopsis fishnellus, a mushroom that grows exclusively in the old growth forest. We have now the largest strain library in the world. Is a deep reservoir of active constituents that upregulate uh, immune factors. That was kind of a the door that opened and is still opening today. So time is short. There's a lot to be discovered. And um, I feel like I'm a student of nature and uh, nature has such an enormous depth of knowledge that we have barely tapped into. My future goals for this company is to spread the word of mycelium throughout the world. Mycelium is a network. It's a cellular network. You know, we are cells also within the network to create communities of individuals across cultural divides, political divides, geographical divides. We are all one community networked together. Once we understand that we're a part of nature, not a part, but pa part within nature, then I think we can all hold hands. We're all in this earth ship together. Uh, it's important that we don't shoot holes in the ship that sustains us and that we work together uh, for our greater commonality of interests and that of our children and future generations.